four, three, two, one. And we have ignition. And we have liftoff of Antares, the 243 mission that brings Cygnus on its third CRS mission to the ISS. Got main engines at 108%. AVI powered on. There's been breaking news. The story is still developing. A rocket launch has now exploded six seconds after launch. I'm here with USA Today editor Doyle Rice, who has more for us. What's going on, Doyle? Yeah, it was an unmanned uh, rocket that exploded about six seconds after takeoff from Wallops Island, Virginia. It was a private uh, rocket that was ferrying uh, cargo and supplies for the International Space Station in uh, just up, up in orbit around the Earth. It was a, at a NASA facility, but the rocket itself was from Orbital Science Incorporated, a private, a private company. So what is NASA doing right now to find out what's happened? Well, they're still analyzing the situation. It only happened a few minutes ago. So officially they're investigating and making sure that the launch area is safe for people to go in and investigate what happened. Now, now, well, it's a stunning video that keeps playing on loop. Stay with us for more on this story on usatoday.com.